Is an ultra luxury supposed to be bespoke? Welcome to the channel. In today's episode, we're gonna review 1033 Somera Road in Bel Air, six bedroom, seven bathroom, 12,000 square foot, according to the builder, and just over an acre lot, listed for 23 million. 888,000. Okay, three things I like about this property. But wait, this is my personal opinion. This is for entertainment, educational purposes. If you have questions, you can contact the listing agents over here and ask them all your questions, okay? Three things I like about it. Number three, open layout. Look, this is open layout done right. I love the volumes, everything is open. You get light coming from every angle, it's awesome. Number two, southwest facing. It's almost as good as south facing you could argue it's even better to the west because you might get a little bit of sunset i'm not gonna say no it's my number two the number one thing i love about this house is the combination of view and land you get this is very rare obviously this was naturally available our dear friend Ramtin over here has busted all these caissons over here to manufacture this backyard for you at a lot of deneros okay now three things I don't like about this property. Hang on, oh, Arvin, before you get into that, can you tell me what ZipSmart has to say about this house? You know, I'm gonna say something different this time. I'm gonna focus on mortgage rate prediction. Right now, according to ZipSmart.ai, the probability of mortgage rate being 6% or less by end of next year is only 33%. And this gauge updates every 15 minutes, and you can use this gauge to see if it's a good idea for you to buy now and refinance later. Because a lot of people bought last year thinking the rates are gonna drop right now, and they did it. They didn't have access to this tool. So it's one of the tools available at zipsmart.ai. Okay, three things I don't like about this property. It's a classic upside down house built by the king of upside down houses himself, Hillside Property Mastro, Brumteen Nostrati. He just does these hillside properties like candy. And this is his latest one. By the way, upside down means you enter from the top, you have to take the stairs to get to the ground level, and that's just weird and not normal. It's basically tells you the lot is not valued as much. Now, the second thing I don't like about this property is it's got six bedroom, seven bath. I got a house in Woodland Hills got the same. It's the same. <laughs> Our houses are the same. <laughs> They're not. Okay, number one thing I don't like about this property is that recently, all Ramtin's properties are starting to look identical to each other. Like he got an amazing deal on bulk on all the material and finishes, and he's just duplicating all of them, which is a huge concern to me because why would a $23,888,000 buyer want to have a replica of that house in another area? Isn't ultra luxury supposed to be bespoke? I think that's a big, big negative. And for that reason, I don't think it's worth 23888000 And interestingly, you got to pay attention here because Ramtin's got three properties on the market. So this is, I believe, the best time for you guys to talk to your agents, go start doing lowball offers on brand new construction or flips, okay? Visit zipsmart.ai if you wanna do AI forecast for your house. Either watch this video or this video if you like my videos, and like and subscribe and share it with your friends, okay? I'll see you in the next video.